feel like half of these vlogs during the summer, I'm just in my bed. <laughs> uh, it's 10 a.m. I was supposed to be at the storage unit at 9.30. Didn't happen. <laughs> I am going to get up. I'm going to have toaster strudel for breakfast. I'm going to go drop off my glasses, go to the storage unit, maybe go to Best Buy. Well, I'm going to pack my lunch before I do, before I go. Because there's a chance I'm probably going to be in the storage unit during lunchtime. And I don't want to go out and buy anything. So I'm going to make a sandwich. So that's what I need to do. Oh, I need to pack too. Because we're going on another trip this weekend. Alright. So. I've already done one trip. One bag of trash. And a few things. Two empty gray boxes. So we can use those to pack. Um. And I'm cleaning out my storage unit. It looks about the same, but I promise you, I'm getting rid of stuff. I also have, I started a Goodwill pile. Um, I finally got one of these. You have to leave your license with them now. So I have to actually be done at the time I'm supposed to be done. So hopefully I will be. And I have my lunch there too. I'll be eating that soon. I'm so sweaty. Like, it's ridiculous. Okay. It's hot. I don't know if you can hear my AC, but it's loud. I'm not turning it off. Now I have a full car. I need to go to Half Price Books. I need to go to Goodwill. I need to go home to put the trash because we can't use the dumpster at the frickin' storage facility because they lock it up, which is stupid. But whatever. I'll just throw it away at the house. So the question now is do I go home and unload what I can into the house? Or do I go to Goodwill first and then go home? Because it's on the way and I don't think I'm going to be out again that way. Maybe I do it tomorrow when I'm doing half price book stuff. Maybe I do half price book stuff tomorrow. Or do I go out and give tomorrow? I'm hungry. I have my lunch. I'm gonna eat my lunch. Probably on the way home. Unload what I can because there's stuff I can pack because there's empty stuff there. And then there's more trash I need to get out of the, the thing. I'm gonna go home first. I ate my lunch in the car and I'm gonna take 15 minutes to just sit and then I'll go back downstairs and get more stuff out of my car. Mostly empty boxes to just put stuff in the boxes. So, I can do that. It's now day two at the storage unit. I'm gonna try and get through the right side because I got through most of the left side yesterday. But unfortunately, a son and father team beat me to the good, uh, cart. So I have to deal with the orange one today. So I finished it within like I think like an hour and I finally have stuff that's only for my classroom and like maybe a few books here and there from like my great aunt Francis but <sighs> so excited that I don't have to come here anymore <laughs> until August. Finally po pocking. <laughs> finally packing all my shoes and this is only like a quarter of what I have. I should get rid of some shoes. I love you. What kind of cake did we just have? A bunt cake? Okay. It's good. I made a pun and it didn't go over very well. <laughs> but it was really funny. was the bunst that she's ever had. <laughs> but Jesse just thought that he had been saying bunt rock the entire time, so I just kept repeating bunts like he was going to get the joke, and he didn't. But explain what the joke was supposed to be. So. It was a pun. It was a pun, because it was the bunst cake. It was the bust bunst. <laughs> <laughs> Can you do it now? It was the. Best? The bunst bunt cake. Like the best bunt cake, but it didn't 
it didn't go over very well. It made me cry because we were laughing so hard. So I mean, it succeeded in that aspect. Yeah. <laughs>